helps to identify the pathogenic organism and plan the treatment accordingly. So the first step is scraping and obtaining of the specimen. The tray includes 15 number blade, 2 slides, blood agar and sabayurox dextros agar. This is the list of the various stains and media used for corneal scraping. 15 number blade is used for scraping. Sharp end of the blade is used to scrape the edge of the ulcer. Material is smeared on the slide for gram stain. At the same time, slide is labeled with name and MRD number of the patient. For KOH, material is inoculated by tapping it on the slide. Slide is labeled with MRD number and name of the patient. After this, more material is obtained for inoculation on culture media. Material is inoculated on blood agar in the form of C shapes. Also, it is inoculated in SDA taking care that the tip of the needle should not touch the test tube and goes directly into the media. Next step is incubation of blood agar and SDA. Blood agar is incubated in the incubator and the temperature is set at 37 degrees Celsius. ST is kept at room temperature. Next step is KOH mount preparation and gram staining. KOH preparation is done by instilling few drops of 10% KOH solution and covering it with a cover slip. The slide is viewed under the microscope. First, 10x lens is used for focusing the field and then the magnification is increased to 40x. The slide is adjusted on the microscope as shown. These are the fungal hyphae seen on KOH mount and growth of same hyphae on SDA. Gram staining is done as per the standard protocol. This is the immersion oil used for 100x immersion technique. Few drops of oil are instilled on the gram stain slide and it is viewed using 100x oil immersion technique. The slide is focused on the microscope as being shown. So these are gram positive kokai seen on gram stain and growth of same kokai on blood agar. We can also see stained fungal hyphae. These are the gram negative bacilli, growth of same bacilli on blood agar. These are the acanthamoeba cysts seen on KOH mount and gram stain.